All right, ladies and gentlemen, I've made it to the afterlife. Let's go ahead and go on this date with Rogue. <sighs> Try again. Maybe you'll find some charm third time around. Hey, Rogue. Ready? Again, you. We going? Where's Johnny? Couldn't make it after all? I'm just your driver. See, you keep him on a short leash. <laughs> Wise beyond your years. This Johnny's Porsche? <laughs> Where'd you get it? That's what was in the container. One Grayson was talking about. Hmm. Okay. <laughs> Got a lot of memories in this car. Let's go. Silver Pixel Cloud, your favorite place? Once, probably. Haven't been there in ages. Drive-ins went out of style a century ago. But Silver Pixel's still hanging in there. Sounds like a preem place for a day. Thought so, too. Which is why I suggested Johnny take me there. A million years ago. So it wasn't his idea? Of course not. His idea of a romantic night out was blowing up Arasaka HQ. I don't know, Rogue. Blowing up Arasaka HQ seems pretty romantic to me. But what do I know? I'm an old school romantic. All right, V. Tell me what's going on. For real. Meaning. Johnny doesn't do a thing without an ulterior motive. So what's in play this time? Johnny's changed. He really does want to spend some time with you. No hooks, no lines, no sinkers. All right. Man, I've never been to a drive-in before. I'd really like to. It looks like a lot of fun. In fact, I haven't been to the movie theater in a while. Ever since, you know, the pandemic happened. I'm fully vaccinated. Just taking it all in. A selfless Johnny Silverhand. Apparently, you're a positive influence on him. I'm fully vaccinated, so I could. Hopefully, the pandemic is uh, running out of steam, so maybe we can... Once again, join our friends and family in the movie theaters. Technically, you can, but you don't want to fuck it up when you're so close to the end, you know? But I do miss movie theaters. Unfortunately, that seems like a trend that's going out of style. It's all about streaming nowadays with the pandemic and whatnot, you know? It was a smarter choice to make, but... Ah, man, I miss... I miss paying $40 for, like, a popcorn and a drink and a ticket. You know what I mean? <laughs> I don't know. It's just the atmosphere that I love the most. Just being there with, like, a bunch of people. And just experiencing the movie as, like, one. Like, when we saw, like, Endgame and stuff. Oh, my God. The atmosphere was just second to none. Here we are. I don't believe it. It really has been years. Managed to shut the whole thing down. V, try to get inside. Can't stop us, won't stop us. We asked you out on a date. All right. Do your thing. I'll watch. Hell yeah. We said you were going to the movies and hell high water. We're going to see a movie. What'd that say? Dr. Havoc and... Raiden? Hmm. There's some money and shit laying here. Money... Let's see here. Okay. Gotta be the past, this. Guess we really are going to the movies. Change of plans. We'll be shutting down Silver Pixel Cloud Night City at the end of the year. There will be no surveillance severance packages offered as stated clearly in the contract. Employees are not entitled to severance pay if they may transfer to another company location. We are happy to offer employees a choice between our Rockford or Laredo locations. The new positions will be and on a short-term contract without benefits. Well, fuck you then. As those locations are also slated to close within six months. So you're just gonna transfer them to a fucking location that's gonna close within six months? You bunch of dickbags. 
The code to the main entrance has been changed to 0000, so that everyone can come and collect their personal effects. Contact Mark Siddons. He's the main... He's the main man in charge of authorizing access. Oh, damn. Those guys are a bunch of dicks. It's like, we're closing... We're, we're, we're taking away your job. We can give you another job, but that job is going to close in six months. What a bunch of fuck muffins. Bam, right, bam, let's go. La la. Well done. Try and get the projector started. I'll get us some seats. Sure thing. Right, let's go check the projector. Can I take a dump first? No? Yeah, all right. I'll hold it. I had beans for lunch. Entrance is open. Beans, what the fuck? Okay. Okay, looks like I found the projector. You wouldn't happen to know how to get it up and run it. Well, let me take a look at it. Not, I'm sure, a good solid bang. We'll get it going. No. Oh, interesting. Bushido 10. Fade to black. Must be a classic by now. Hm. Looks like an 80s action flick. I like 80s action flicks. They're good popcorn movies. What do we got here? I'll drink that. And I'll drink your booze. And let's see what we got here. Not to see. Oh. Look at that. Last played Bushido 10. Perfect. Looks like a spurt of runny shit. V, we're at a drive-in. Movie's the last thing we care about. Just want some background noise, a little blood, tits, and gore, that sort of thing. Bushido will give you that. All right, V, run along. I'll take it from here. Have fun, you crazy kids. Just the best spot. Hop on up. Hey, front row and center. I like to be up in the uh like the the back row and see the uh screen better. I don't like being in the front row, it makes cranks my, just cramps my neck. Oh, so that's how you do it. Rogue, I don't need this world anymore, but I need you. Johnny, I was wrong about you, and it's a crying shame. This is how you imagine this evening going? Always knew things would have to change for us to just go out and catch a movie. Never imagined they'd change this much. Let's pretend it's 2015, huh? We just met, and I got no idea what a bastard you are. But I like 2077, Rogue. A far inferior version. Okay, so it's 2015. If you could do it all again, what would you change? Anything at all? Do everything in my power not to lose you. Johnny, I hey, hey, hey. What's this? Nothing. It's just had a lot of time to think while you were away. What ifs and all that. All that counts is I'm back with you. I think that's way better than any what if. But all we got's this one night. It's more than I ever could have asked for. Rogue, I'm here on borrowed time in a borrowed body. But I'm here.
That's not right. <sighs> Mina, not fair to V. Not fair to you. Tried so hard to pretend nothing's changed. To pretend I'm the same rogue you knew. Actually managed to fool myself for a little. <sighs> Get back on my own. Rogue! Fuck. Rogue's gone. Yep. Guess things did not go swimmingly. Nope. Was gonna be a nice night at the drive-in. Now she's mad and won't tell me what about. Any guesses? Remember Grayson? How they spoke? How weird it was? Weird's not the word, I don't think. He was toying with her. Could be something to that. Gotta mull it over. For now, take me to North Oak. That's supposed to help you figure out Rogue? No. Carrie. Tell you once we're there. Movie was a turd wrapped in crepe paper. Wow. Good to know. Yeah, Bushido 10 was probably not a good movie. We all know Bushido 3 was where it was at, right? Know what I mean? Uh, but anyways, ladies and gentlemen, I think that is all the time I have for this episode. Sorry to leave it on a sad note. I was hoping that date would go swimmingly and would leave on a high note. But you can't always get what you want, you know what I mean? The fuck is this? Hang on. What is up here? Rare item. Okay. Well, anyways, ladies and gentlemen, as always, if you like this episode, there's more shit over here. <laughs> Easily distracted. <laughs> more stuff. Okay. Anyways, ladies and gentlemen, as always, if you like this episode, you know what you gotta do. I love you guys, and I'll see you next episode.